an HQ when you can have an HQ spaceship and fly at supersonic speed. Thanks for your help, Featherbrain. But none of you are coming on this ride. No! <laughs> gotcha. Mm. Oh. Look, we're going to lose HQ. No, Romeo only found the rocket function because of me using my tablet. It's okay, Owlette, but this doesn't look good. We have to do something. <gasps> and I know what. I'm going after that rocket myself without the tablet. But even you can't fly that fast. Oh, yes, I can. Time to be a hero. Super Gecko Muscles! Ugh. Okay, Catboy, hold on to one of my feet. And when I shout fly, Gecko, you grab the other. Okay, here comes Super Sonic Owlette. Yeah! Ready, set, Brand! fly! Romeo and Robot, while I quietly fly Gecko to the PJ Picture Player and drop him in. Right. Then I deactivate the rocket in Super Gecko Camouflage. Be <laughs> <laughs> Fox! Manny, hit the wiper! One more minute. Okay, but turn the sound down. Super Gecko Camouflage! <sighs> What? Oh, I should have known that this thing would be unreliable. Anybody order pizza? I can build it. Right, robot? Oh, forget it. At least HQ will be destroyed once and for all. Let's go. What? No! Enjoy the trip, Romeo. We'll keep your teleporter nice and safe here in HQ. Ah! Sentient food? That's impossible. Unless its molecular structures mutated into superfood. It's been, been genetically, genetically engineered, engineered to protect, protect the, the flint of the winner. Pizza! Oh! Pizza, 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 pizza! Oh, dear! Oh, this plane is built to last one thousand flights. Hey, we've got a problem here. Houston, we have a problem. We've got a pretty fire, doesn't make any sense. We've got multiple cosmic and warning, Houston. That was lucky. Lucky? We're stuck at the North Pole. But now we might meet Father Christmas. And the Arctic Elves. I suppose we might see some penguins. Oh, I like penguins. Penguins live at the South Pole. This is the North Pole. What's that waddling towards us there? Penguins! Happy. Not penguins. Arctic oh. elves. Oh, not again. It's my twin brother. Are you all right? Hello, oh, I little we better brother. Put them back together. Hello. Are you Everything hurts. Hurts. I'm getting most of you. No, I'm older. But you're twins. I'm older and wiser by three minutes. Hardly older at all. I am the wiser, older elf. Ah, ah. When you little boys have stopped squabbling, maybe the wisest person here can work out how we get back home. Oh, uh. Maybe Father Christmas could help. Very clever. Follow me, everyone, to the house of Father Christmas. Father Christmas! Oh, 
Maybe if you're lucky, Nanny Plum, you'll see a penguin. <laughs> Violet, can I borrow your wand? Okay. Oh, look, wise old elf, a penguin at the North Pole. Oh, very clever, Nanny Plum. What? <laughs> Gaston stopped moving. Interesting. Gaston has frozen. Oh, no! We need to get the ladybird somewhere warm. Yes, yeah. insects don't like the winter. Here we are, the house of Father Christmas. What happened? It, it looks like the a Christmas pudding. He was oh, doing his taxes. Doing his taxes. Yes, little brother. I built it myself. Is this the fool when, that was on the wall? When I yeah. said wonderful, I meant it's okay. <laughs> this is Father Christmas's study. We can thaw the ladybird out by the fire. Are these Father Christmas's slippers? Yes, they are. Wow! His feet are bigger than all of us. I think Gaston is thawing out. Bow, bow. Gaston's back! <laughs> Box 571 delivered. Oh, thank you, little brother. It would be simply spiffing if next year you made the last toy delivery before Christmas Eve. What? At least I make toys. You just wrap them up. Ah, but wrapping toys is the important bit. You have to be as old and wise as me to understand that. You're no wiser than me, but I am by three minutes. And I always will be. Ahem. Talking of wrapping presents, shouldn't somebody be doing that by now? It's Christmas Eve. Goodness me, you're right. To the present wrapping machines. Reports just then say he was, in fact, doing his taxes. Doing his taxes? On a wall? It all seems very peculiar. The main question being asked, why That's was he doing his taxes? That's the last of this oh, year's why, presents Why, why, wrap. why? Time for a holiday. Hurrah! We've just brought one more box of toys to wrap. Sorry to end your holiday. That's okay. Arctic elves love wrapping presents. And we're... Oh, no! Arctic elves! We brought you toy robots, dolls, space rockets, and cars. Not bad. You've done a good job, brother. Oh, thank you, brother. When the presents are wrapped up, who delivers them? Ho, ho, ho! I deliver them, of course. Father Christmas! Call Daddy! It isn't home I time feel yet. A spot of bother. Yes, we need some help getting home. I've got some work to do tonight. I could drop you off on the way. Are you going our way? I'm That's me. I'm the coach. Yay! A basketball teacher is called a coach. That penguin's a long way from home. I'd better drop him off, too. Is everybody ready? Yes, Daddy Pig! Then let's go! Have you got a present for our friend Lucy? Lucy? She's a little girl we know. Of course there's a present for her. Why do people always have such small chimneys? We could deliver the presents for you. All right. Put these presents in Lucy's Christmas stocking. Don't forget the tangerine. <gasps> Someone's coming. Keep still. Pretend to be a statue. That's odd. Some of the decorations have fallen off the tree. This little elf must go here. And this pretty fairy should be at the top of the tree. Thank <laughs> you.
waiting on your roof. Santa? On my roof? Cool. Merry Christmas, I'm afraid. I have to deliver presents to all the children of the world. How many deliveries have you done so far? One. Well, good luck. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Good. Now we're all here. Christmas can begin. Hooray! <laughs> 